You want me to sweat? <laughs> no, I can't say a lot. Uh... <laughs> nah, no, I'll just keep it. I don't want to start swearing because when I start speaking Swedish, then I start swearing. So okay. I just okay. <laughs> that that's what that's what most of the guys taught me swearing. <laughs> okay, so we we speak in English then. Yeah. Kaffe. Nej, tack. Te. Ja, tack. Över en kopp te i centrala Helsingborg satte vi oss ner för att i lugn och ro gå igenom det som varit och det som kommer. Den lilla korta perioden emellan handlar om Ghana. It was also fun because I met my family, I met my friends and I was also doing a lot of work like uh, a lot of like charity works in Ghana like visiting orphanage, uh, go back to the community where I came from and doing a lot for, for the community so it was really good. Där har fartfantomen tränat mycket styrka och kondition. Yeah, I'm feeling really good because I've been training hard in Ghana and during the holidays I, I wasn't just uh, chilling with my family or friends. I was also training, and, but I have a slight problem with my groin, so I'll just treat that. David Ackham är bara 23 år, men får räkna med att vara den stora stjärnan i det HF som tappat starka namn. Det råder inga tvivel om att han saknar mig Malango. Yeah, yeah, he was, he was a good friend, friend of me and and if you on the pitch, the way we play, we understand each other and 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 most people say I play well if it's on the pitch and that's that's true and but that's life. I will miss him on the pitch and also in in, in my everyday life. So I, I have to just get used to not playing playing with him and and get used to playing with other players as well. HF har ansträngd ekonomi och bland de spelare som skulle kunna dra in kosing via försäljning finns definitivt David Ackham. Men om HF skulle vilja sälja lär de få övertyga huvudpersonen själv först. <laughs> yeah, my, my dream is to move to a bigger league in the future but I've told the club, I've told the club, I've told, I've spoke to my agent, I don't think January is the right time for me to move so... Uh, if the club decides to sell me in general, I don't think for me, I'm, I'm not going to accept it. Do you know if there are any interests from clubs right now? <laughs> uh, I don't want to talk about that one. <laughs> 2012 han David Ackham spela 10 matcher och göra 3 mål. 2013 blev det 27 matcher och 10 mål. 2014. I don't think I'll have much pressure on me. Uh, it will be the same like last year, but I know other players who who, uh, who also try to come up. So that that will be a good thing. If we lose somebody, I think the other players who wants to come up, so they will try to show and they will, they will do what this is. Yeah, but it seems like you you're gonna be one of the stars in the team. Uh, you you were last season too, but I think even more this season. What do you feel about that? Yeah, I feel really good. I always I want to be regarded as a as a big player in the team so to have more responsibilities and and if I get that now then I'll be happy I'll try to to show to show more of my skills and last season you scored 10 times satisfied with that or what, what are you thinking I wouldn't say I was satisfied but I would I would say it was okay because that was my first full season in the league and and I scored 10 goals but I could have done better comparing to to what I can do so the, I just went back to Ghana and I thought about what went wrong and what I can do better. So hopefully I can correct them this season. What will you change? A lot, not a lot, but I'll change, I'll change uh, certain things about how I play and that's, that's a secret for me now. Okay. <laughs> I, don't can, want, I don't want you to keep come it out. for yeah, yourself. Yeah, I'll keep it. <laughs> När man är liten finns ingen dröm som är just för liten. Man drömmer stort. Man drömmer om de bästa lagen. David Ackham vet vad han vill sen tiden i England i Nike Academy. Uh, for me, I dreamt of playing for Arsenal. And, and I know Arsenal is a big team, so you have to really work hard uh, to get a chance to play for Arsenal. But I, I, I was really uh, lucky to play against Arsenal and I had as in Wenger coaching me once, so uh, still, I still have a dream of playing for Arsenal and I hope one day I will, uh, my dream will come true. Thanks a lot, David, and uh, good luck this season. Very good. <laughs>